Building Legos. I love Legos. I need to actually like build some Lego. Because I have like, what, one, two, three, four, I five. Lot. I have six kits that I need to actually do. When I have time. Yeah, right. That's never going to happen. Welcome to 5 Minutes with Frankie. I love you and Jesus loves you too. Wait a minute. It's That's Monday. That's the end. Push play. It's push play. With me, Mario. Yeah. Good morning, beautiful people. So, building things. Building up. Um, I would love to go to the tallest building in the world. No. I think it's in uh, Abu Dhabi or uh, Emirates. What is that? The United Emirates. Yeah. Or something. Um, it's huge. But I don't think, I think you made that up. No, really. The, there is the tallest building. Well, of course there's a tallest building. I don't think you know where it is. It's there. I'm Look it up. up. Anyway. Up. So just think of building that. Thank you. Oh, building the Brooklyn Bridge. Um, actually, people died on that building that bridge, or uh, building a tunnel through a mountain. Yeah. That would be really cool too. Or a tunnel underneath the water. If you go to Delaware, we have this really famous uh, bridge. That, actually, it's in Maryland. Well, okay, Maryland, whatever. Uh, Maryland to Virginia, um, and uh, you go under <clears throat> and you come up, and then there's like a, a the, restaurant right in the middle of it. The restaurant's gone. No. Somebody told me, I forget who it was, oh. said that they've been on it and the restaurant's gone. Oh, the memories. Anyway, know. so, you know, you build things and it's really cool. Um, but there's risk involved and there's hard work involved and there's, you know. You're right. Thank you. It is in Dubai, United Arab Emirates. Emirates. It's it tall is 2,717 feet tall. That's a really tall building. And the Tower of Babel. They, they worked hard on that, too. So, you know, you work hard building these things, and um, if you don't have the right foundation, it crashes. It, it, it's done. You have to have a good foundation. And then you build from there. Well, Ephesians chapter 2, verse 22, gives us the foundation of what our Christianity should be based on. The cool thing is that we base it on this, and he never moves. Never. He's a permanent foundation. He's a permanent foundation. He is, oh my goodness, permanent foundation. <laughs> he, he literally has not moved in his position on things since the creation of time. And the cool thing is that he cannot do some stuff. He cannot go against himself. He cannot sin. He cannot <clears throat> put you into sin. <clears throat> God is our foundation. So Ephesians. Our permanent foundation. Permanent foundation. Ephesians chapter 2, verse 22. So think of Legos. Think of building these beautiful buildings and these things. Here we go. In him, you also are being built together. Now, now listen to that. In him, you also are being built together. So that has the idea that there are other people, other things that are being built together on this foundation. So we do need each other. We do need to come to church and come to Bible study and, and be with other Christians to build this together. In him you also are being built up together into a dwelling place for God by the Spirit. And so where does the Spirit dwell? Well, the Spirit, is inside of, is the Spirit dwells inside of us and we are called the church. We are not a physical building. We are a spiritual building, building built up with God. And so what does a spiritual building need? Well, it needs a foundation, first of all, which is God. It needs a to be permanent foundation. A permanent foundation. It needs to be built up together with other people. It needs to have everybody working together to the same goal and serving each other and serving the world and serving others. And it needs to have people working out these things in their life, even if it hurts, even if if there's bumps and bruises or nails in the wrong place or, you know, lights are in the wrong place, we got to move them. But we have to build together. And when we build, it's going to hurt. We're going to have some times that we disagree. But at least we have the foundation where we agree and we build from there. And that's why I don't understand denominations or other things because we're all going towards God. We need to have him as a foundation 
and build together. So my encouragement for you today is, are you building on a foundation of money, yourself, the world, all that will follow it. But God is the permanent foundation that we should be building on. Are you building on him? I love you, Jesus loves you too. You have a great Monday.